Still alive this legislative session, but one controversial bill didn't make it to the Senate today. 41 NBC's Alexa Rodriguez joins us now with more on the 2016 General Assembly's crossover day. Crossover day is crucial. It's the last day bills can transfer between the House and Senate chambers with enough time to be considered for a full floor vote before sign die, which is the last day of the legislative session. Two House bills and a resolution were up for a vote today, and representatives decided to keep two of them alive. State Representative Alan Peake's proposal to expand Georgia's medical marijuana law will go to the state Senate for review. The Georgia House of Representatives approved the bill with a vote of 152 to 8. Last week, a committee removed Peake's in-state growing model but added to the list of conditions that can use medical cannabis to treat their symptoms. I can't come before you today um, without saying how disappointed I am that we're not moving forward with uh, cultivation in this bill. Um, <coughs> disappointed um, for a lot of families and citizens that would potentially could benefit from that. The fireworks bill also passed the House Monday. It would limit the hours people are allowed to shoot fireworks off on New Year's Eve, New Year's Day, July 3rd, and July 4th. It also gives local governments the ability to create their own noise restrictions. The casino gambling bill was postponed until the next legislative day. The proposal would allow a few casino resorts to open in the state. State Representative Rusty Kidd said the money the resorts make will go toward rural hospitals, the Hope Scholarship, and tax relief for Georgia residents. Here we have the opportunity to create a new, uh, new source of funds, a very large source of new funds, and it could go towards you know, rural health care or health care in Georgia. The medical marijuana and fireworks bills will be sent to a Senate committee for review. They have to pass that committee before going to a floor vote. Students at an elementary school in Houston County.